I think this is a great topic because I have asked many, 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 many graduates of NLP, what are your biggest challenges with NLP? And one of the top ones that comes back is, I still don't know how to describe it, especially to lay people. Yeah, I literally this week came across a, a recent, someone who just recently become certified in NLP, wants to utilize it in her business. And she's like, how do I talk about this? How do I describe this? So I'll, I'll give you like my, my standard version. I have a lot of different ways to answer it. And if that doesn't give you an indication about what the fuck NLP is all about, <laughs> um, if I really want to get into the details of it with somebody or, or describe it as accurately as I can. NLP is a study of language and how it affects and influences our perception of an experience of reality. A study of how language affects our reality is a very simple way to put it. I've been going more storytelling sort of metaphors. Metaphors, yeah, and that's where I always go next. Imagine blankety blank. <laughs> My standard metaphor is user's manual for your brain, which I really, really like. Yeah. Uh, and, and I usually tell it as a story. I'll be like, you know, most people, they come into this world and we all have access to the most powerful computer uh, in the known universe. Um, and it's your body, it's your brain, it's your unconscious mind, but nobody knows how to run the thing. Nobody gave you a manual. It's like somebody gave you the most complex computer in the universe and there's no markings on any of the keys and you're just pushing buttons. Yeah. And, and some people, I love this, some people, they discover something uh, where if you push this one button, the little blinky thing moves over. Every, like almost like every time. And it's amazing. And they're like, I'm gonna write a book and I, I'm gonna call it the space bar. <laughs> And they write a book about the space bar, but here's the problem. When you're in another program and you press the space bar, it doesn't make the little thing move over. It makes the whole page move down. And that's why most psychology books are kind of crap because they don't talk about the whole system. They talk about one thing in one person's personal experience and they say, this is how I view the world as opposed to really digging down to the root code of the mind. The point is you gotta answer it based on the person you're talking to. Yeah, in, in town at networking stuff, it's like, what do you do? Well, so I, I do ninja Jedi stuff. Yeah. To help people quickly shift patterns in their Completely. life. That kind of stuff. Or, or, like, or like, what is NLP if they ask? I was like, well, so NLP is like, you know how Las Vegas has the best buffets? Like, but in general, when people think buffet, but also good buffet, because people can think of shitty buffet. Right? Yeah. When you think of a great buffet, NLP is like the brilliant woman who comes in with a giant purse and comes into the best buffet in Vegas and then fills up on prime rib and all, <laughs> like omelets and all of the great like tiny desserts, all of the stuff that's amazing from the buffet and she takes that with her. <laughs> and then, and then they're blinking. I'm following, I'm with you. This is a great <laughs> metaphor. And so, so, so that, and then, and then somehow she now has all of the great stuff that could ever be had from the buffet <laughs> of life and business. Uh, yes. That's, that's NLP. <laughs>